Hello traders, this is Rich from TradeSite. This is a look at our market leading stocks via our proprietary scans for the coming session. This is going to be for the Friday of the non-farm non -farm payroll number for this month. This is going to be for uh, this, the 7th of February 2014. Well, we have uh, <clears throat> definitely a rebound day today, but we don't have a lot uh, of support from, the, from, our, from our scans as far as signals for tomorrow. We do have an upside CPS in Google, which put in a, uh, a pretty strong showing at the end of the day. And we also have the uh, same condition in BlackBerry. Note the, uh, note the drop off in volume that we're seeing. Now, there's a lot of uh, volume deviations to the downside. So uh, while we are bouncing, certainly the, uh, the pressure to the upside is uh, not, nearly, not nearly what it was to the downside the last couple of sessions. We've got a contra candle to the downside and a sign, and again, that's on light volume. One of the only things that was trading good volume today in the NASDAQ patch was Altera. Moving on to the financials, uh, these are definitely uh, a little bit, a little bit better to buy. Certainly more, more so than the uh, sparse uh, amount of signals that we had in the uh, the Nasdaq patch. We've got a fair amount of upside CPS conditions, so uh, definitely have some uh, some potential uh, two-day breakouts ready if we uh, develop an upward bias in the market tomorrow after the number. Uh, we had a open close deviation in the CME, and we also had it in Sally May. The Sally May was on, on pretty light volume, though. Take a look at the energy patch. Not a lot here. Um, CHK was real weak. That's going out with a downside CPS condition, and that one has a pretty strong open-close deviation on good volume. Arch Coal uh, traded good volume and had a weak session, 2% below the day's open. Moving on to the generals. We're back to mixed again here. Um, kind of the buys are being uh, paired off by the uh, by the sell conditions. Uh, open close deviation in Best Buy. We've got uh, a couple of volume bumps. We've got one in Disney. That one's got an RPS and and a contra candle to the downside. So we should be looking at that on the downside tomorrow. We also have that same condition in Coca-Cola. Uh, we've got a downside CPS in uh, Verizon VZ. So that may be one to watch tomorrow if we do, do develop some downside. As far as the housing names go, uh, housing was real strong today. Uh, DHI uh, open close deviation on good volume, and we had a close to a deviation here in uh, Havnani and HOV. CSX in the transportation uh, sector put in a uh, upside CPS, so I could garner some more bids tomorrow. And finally, on to the commodities. Uh, really light volume for the most part here today. We had uh, an upside signal in ACH, and we've got a downside RPS uh, in Potash. All right, folks, as always, thanks for listening. This has been Rich for TradeSite.